Hey everybody, Donald, Top Wolf 1964 here, of course. Um, this video, I'm out here today. I'm just uh, testing my uh, summertime gear setup with my pistol belt. Um, I have a <clears throat> just a dry bag with my hammock, uh, a rain jacket, uh, minus my food, which I'm going to have in there. This is uh, just a quick, uh, this is just a quick, uh, quick hike. My new part here, just trying out a, checking out a new part of the trail. Um, quick and simple, a couple hours. To see how my summertime pistol belt setup comes in handy. So stay tuned. This will be a uh, quick one. So we'll be back. Hey everybody, just uh, sat down here and uh, just admiring the, the view of the lake. Nice cool shade. So, yeah, this is my favorite spot I think of my, my new area. The first one that I'm scouting out, so. Peaceful and quiet. So, I don't want to bore you guys too much, so sit back here. I'm just going to enjoy it and get back on the trail. Stay tuned. Alrighty, I think I just got a minor adjustment, just uh, sewed me a loop on the bottom of the, uh, the dry bag uh, so I can attach it to the center of the uh, pistol belt, stop it from swaying, not bad, but uh, just to stop it from swaying a little bit, uh, not too bad. Feels good. Said I'm just uh, minus the food and what else am I missing? Uh, a stove. Um, rather be the alcohol or the hobo stove. I think uh, I'm gonna go back to the using the hobo stove a little more often. So, yeah, it's got everything in it, minus my food and my, my stove, so, feels good. Uh, be good for a uh, day, overnight. So, I got my, got my Hennessy hammock in there, so. We'll mosey on and see what we can find out out here on this, uh, New part of the trail. Stay tuned, guys.
Alrighty guys, we're uh, making new trails out here now. Definitely being uh, careful of where I walk. Florida and there's snakes around here. We'll get very mad if you step on them. No! Oh, wait a minute, vine there. So, definitely how much we are going, that's for sure. Wait a minute, vines and snakes and just gotta well, be careful, that's all. So, uh, let me adventure on more. Maybe I'll give you a turn the camera around and see you guys what I'm looking at here. <laughs> Sorry about the headache there. <laughs> Florida Woods. That's where I just uh, come from, in that direction. So yeah, there's a uh, 360 view and I'm going that away. So we'll be back guys. talking about right here. Good old snake right there. I think this is my this is my first uh, snake. Barrows, buddy, I am not gonna pick him up. Because I forgot my colors. Yellow, black, red. Um, I think he's a bad guy. I'm gonna leave him alone. This is why. This is why you look down in Florida when you walk. And you don't sleep on the ground. Red touches yellow. Dead like a feller. Is that it? Oh. How did I forget that? I'm gonna have to brush up on my snakes. We're gonna let him go on. I think uh, I should have dispatched him. <laughs> uh, nope, let him go. Definitely gonna find a bye bye fella. <laughs> Get the Woo! Alrighty guys, uh now that he's uh he's on his way, um I stopped and gathered my thoughts uh, over the excitement and stuff. That was the uh eastern um coral snake. Um, venomous, uh, not poisonous, but uh, venomous, uh, 
He was uh, definitely an adult one. Uh, looked pretty, but he was, uh, he's deadly. Uh, the story does, or the little saying says, if yellow touches red, it kills a fellow. If yellow touches black, it's a friend of Jack. So he was definitely, that was definitely uh, yellow touching red, venomous. Uh, Eastern coral snake. Oh, now that I got, you know, in the excitement, you know, you just kind of, oh, I want to get the pictures and the video and make sure it all comes out, you know, just kind of, oh, you know, things run through your head, just slow down a little bit, you know, don't, I didn't run up there and touch him anyway, um, kind of know better living in Florida. Uh, like I said, it's only, it's only about the fifth one that I've seen, uh, since I've been living in Florida, so that's why I had to kind of had to stop and remember the little the little rhyme that goes that goes with them guys uh, so he is venomous um, they had just leave him alone let him go in his direction I'm gonna go in my direction and yeah let him go he's doing his thing so I'm not gonna immediately cause just cuz he's out here and, and venomous just gonna kill him uh, so let's move on and I'm going to be uh, looking down like I should be, especially when I'm busting, when I'm busting trail, uh, off trail, uh, definitely got to be double focused where you, where you step. So stay tuned guys, we'll be back. Alrighty everybody. I'm thinking that spot back there was a bad location to do a uh, stealth overnight. Even though I would be up in my hammock. Uh, that's uh, Mr. Snake's area. I know he, he was a uh, he was a poisonous one. I don't want to you know I don't want to kill anything unless I have to. You know he just. Uh, Doing this thing out here in nature, you know, just don't uh, see something like that. If you're moving on, just uh, leave it alone. Uh, take pictures or whatever, but uh, don't just uh, kill it to, to kill it. It's uh, doing its doing its nature thing. So um, we'll be back with some more. Alrighty, everybody. Um, had uh, my pistol belt uh, set up on me uh, a couple hours. It's not too bad. It rides up a little bit because it's real heavy. In the, it's not real heavy, but it's you know heavier in the back. But that's no problem. Just uh, tug on the old stirrups here and reset, and off you go. Uh, little minor adjustments. And yeah, there's a way to work out. Uh, maybe paint this bag, if, or maybe find another one that's kind of like uh, OD green instead of white. But it, it doesn't matter. Um, Bigfoot doesn't uh, care what color your uh, your gear is. Uh, it's not a fashion statement, but. Uh, Yeah, we just uh, leave this one a quick one, hopefully. Um, definitely gonna go uh, hit my uh, hit the books on the <clears throat> on the snakes. Now that it's uh, summertime and they're out probably more, so I just want to be uh, be sharp on it again. I don't want to, <clears throat> and I'm getting old. You know the old eyes. You know, you got to kind of think of it, you know, you got to stop and think, but with any snakes, you don't want to just run up there and go nose to nose with it. Uh, 
do you research uh, even uh, refresh your old memory like I said I've been living down here in Florida all my life uh, and that's only probably the fourth or fifth one I've seen uh, so but they do do run across them uh, so just uh, new uh, new season uh, just brush up on your uh, poisonous venomous animals that you may run across in your area uh, just to give you a refresher but let me get out of here let you guys get on to another YouTube video so appreciate your views your comments and uh, any suggestions as always leave them in the comment box below and I'll try to answer what I can the best way I can so till the next video guys we'll see you